There is no such thing as the perfect selfie shot. In times, you know, as recent as 120 years ago, mirrors had not proliferated. People would look at their own reflection in clear water, in a pond, in a glass refractory. But looking at one's image was not something that was constantly done. You would look at somebody else, but you didn't have mirrors. Now we have mirrors everywhere, and we have cameras everywhere. And so looking at ourselves in the mirror in the morning is actually not a bad idea. I mean really looking. I mean looking into what I call the windows to heaven, which are the eyes. While you're brushing your hair, having a good look at yourself. It's a bit of personal time. It's a bit like that question, who am I? What am I going to achieve today? Do I have time to stop and breathe and to say thank you for being on this earth? Do I have an ability to overcome the problems and challenges that might present themselves today? Doing that is normal. Because we're made in the image and likeness of God, a creator, we're the created. Our children are our creations. So looking at one's image is very normal. It's a normal practice. However, that perfect image will never come if we're looking for it through a camera. I think that's an outward thing. What's important is something called the soul, the heart. What condition is your heart in? And today, most people don't want to go towards that spiritual self. There's an outward self and there's an inward self. And in, in, in my uh, belief, you've got the body and you've got the soul. But the body is temporal. It, it breaks down. It gets sick. It has a, lot, a limited lifetime. And so we age. And so the perfect selfie will never come. We keep changing. We don't stay the same. I could never say I have a perfect shot of my child. In fact, the perfect shot is usually when we don't have the camera in hand and we're not thinking about the photo. Usually those moments of intimacy come when we don't have that technology in our hands. It's intimate because the only thing that's there is the person next to you. So is there a perfect hashtag selfie? I'd say no. But surely there would be nice representations of ourselves throughout different times in our life, like our wedding, our 21st birthday. These are special. These are great memories to have. So perfection, I think, is in the hands of God. There is no one who is ugly. There is no one who is super beautiful. Everyone created because they are individuals. They are humans. They have a right to be free. Everyone, in that sense, is beautiful in God's eyes. The perfect selfie is that where we're showing our innermost self but that's the one that I wouldn't want to share with most of the world. It's a personal selfie. That's, that's the perfect selfie. It's a personal one. It's one that matters to me. It's one that matters to my family or someone I love.